gun high tech with these cats. Night vision bugs. We even got a wire up in their litter box. I can't understand what they're saying. Do you speak Cornish Rex? Does anybody here speak Cornish Rex? Oh, hell. Cat found the wire. And now he's playing with it. God damn it. Three months down the drain. Dusty, dusty, dusty. You couldn't be in more trouble if you were in a room full of rocking chairs. You think this is a game, Dusty? Life's just one big ball of string. Bad news, we found your bell collar over on Jefferson. Yeah, your scent is all over that alley. Meow. 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 It's a lot of bodies, Dusty. You wanna talk now? Look at Mr. Mao. Look at him. I thought he was your Tom. You used to chase mice together since you were kittens. Mr. Mao didn't do nothing. And he still got clipped. Do you speak, Tabby? Tabby, mother I bring that Doberman in here. He hates cats almost as much as I do. Oh, I'm sorry, officers. I wanted to talk to my client, if that's okay with you. Detective Bell, Detective McNulty, maybe you can get some coffee or trim your mustaches. Ugh, stupid constitution. Stupid lawyer. Are you checking me out? I think he was checking me out. What'd you tell the cops, Dusty? Hey, don't act like you have a hairball now. Not with me, I'm your lawyer. Listen, everything's gonna be fine. I got you going in front of Judge Levy tomorrow, and Judge Levy is partial to cats. So if you're lucky, you would be serving between two and five years of your nine lives. But I might be able to plead that down to one. You'll have to take the psych test, though. Hey, do you wanna stay in here or do you wanna get out? I don't make the rules. I wish I did then you and I would be party town. Am I right? Am I right? Yeah, give it up. Give that up, <laughs> yeah. It's gonna be all right. You're a cool cat. Real cool cat. All right, weapons check. You got your spray bottles? Cats hate water, keeps them off the couches. All right, we're going into this cat house. This, high value target. This is Mrs. Mandelbaum. Got it? We're going in. Don't cry. It'll only be 20 to 30 years. That place is like an opium den. A couple of guys got some scratches. No problem, really. I mean, it's part of the job. Yeah, we've had some, uh, some rambunctious cats in there. Overall, good bust, you know? We got uh, 16 ounces of catnip. Street value, that's like $4. So, uh, you know, we cut that out of the community, save some lives. That's a 
cat house, madam. What a waste. Some people say this program isn't working. That for every cat we bust, there's another Siamese or American curl to take his place. Some even say the dogs are supplying all the nip. They say this one dog, Barksdale, is supplying all the nip to the west side. I'm not here for the debate or to think about the big picture. I'm here to bust cats doing illegal feline things. That's my job.